my friends and welcome to the video. So today we're gonna be doing something a little bit different than like a normal cheat day that I do. Um, we're gonna be eating gas station food for the entire day. So this idea is from my buddy Mickey and uh, yeah, I think it would be a really cool concept to just try out different foods from different gas stations all day long. So we did go to gas station, gas station. <laughs> so we did go to racetrack and i think this is probably the first time i've ever purchased food from a racetrack so i did get a bunch of different random things a slice of pizza a chicken empanada and you guys know we have to start the day off with a donut as well as a coffee colombian coffee by the way so without further ado let's just dive in all right folks i'm going to be starting with this pizza so it is pepperoni pizza it happens to be one of my favorite pizzas and if you guys did miss my full day of eating pizza, definitely check that out. It has a lot of really good tasty pizza, so I don't know how this is gonna hold up. Let's give it a go. It's actually not too bad. It kind of tastes like a, a cold Elio's pizza. I really do enjoy Elio's pizza, but not when it's cold. <laughs> yeah, this is so random too. I'm having pizza for breakfast. Mm. Oh, I did hear that Racetrack does have like a breakfast pizza, but I did not see it, so I did get the pepperoni. All right, and we also have a Colombian coffee, lots of cream, lots of sugar. Next up, we do have a chicken empanada. Look at that. Um, I'd have to say this is okay. Okay. So I've had a lot of really tasty empanadas with my girlfriend Laura. So um, yeah, I don't think the racetrack empanada can compete with. Um, actual real empanadas but it's not too bad but it's not too good either <laughs> all right and last but not least we do have this cake batter donut this is a Krispy Kreme donut and I absolutely love Krispy Kreme donuts and um, I didn't even know that there was a Krispy Kreme inside of that racetrack because the last time I got Krispy Kreme I drove an hour just to get some donuts. So um, here we go. Mm. Damn, that's delicious. The feeling is so amazing. It's like a, it's kind of like a vanilla -y cake batter frosting. And I love like vanilla frosting, like on cakes and stuff, like fire. <sighs> Ooh, all right, well, uh, that is the start of the day. Again, I didn't eat a crazy amount to start off this day. I wanted to go to more restaurants to try more, well, more gas stations to try more different food options instead of just eating a whole ton from racetrack and then being full for so many hours um, if I just eat a little bit smaller meals throughout the day then I can eat more but uh, yeah that is the start of this cheat day hope you guys enjoyed it so far and I'll be back with some more food shortly I'd like to thank the sponsor of today's video slate so slate is a new better chocolate milk it has 20 grams of protein zero added sugar and it's 100% lactose Free. Slate comes in three different flavors, chocolate milk, dark chocolate milk, and espresso chocolate milk that has 150 milligrams of caffeine. That's equivalent to two shots of espresso. You can crack it open to kickstart your morning, have it post-workout after the gym, a 3 p.m. pick-me-up, a healthy snack, and anything and everything in between. Oh, that's tasty. If you love chocolate milk but are trying to cut the sugar, or if you're just looking for a delicious new way to add protein to your diet, chug a Slate today. Slate milk is delicious, chocolatey, and satisfying, and you can get 15% off your first order with Slate with code NICK15. 
Click the link down in the description box down below and thank you, Slate. Alrighty folks, we are back with some more food and for this stop we did go to Wawa. Wawa does have an amazing selection of sandwiches. I was going to get like a, a meatball sandwich but I was like, you know what, I kind of want to get something that has higher protein. So I did go with the ham and Swiss. Pretty big sandwich if you ask me. So we do have ham, uh, Swiss cheese, lettuce, tomato, avocado, mayonnaise and mustard and then also got a bag of takis and my favorite candy bar in the world the fast break i haven't had one of these and i can't even remember the last time but it's definitely been a while very excited for that and then we do have a i'd eat those pineapple all right here we go time for lunch from wawa Mm. That's just amazing. Nothing. Oh yeah. And here we have some Takis. I really enjoy these because they're, they have a really nice kick to them. And um, uh, definitely very unique. Mm. <laughs> so they're basically like a, I'd say like a Frito chip, but more like in a, a roll and then sprinkled with like hot chili pepper. Mm. And lime. I know what, let's put some of the Takis on the sandwich. This is like full. Not bad. <laughs> All right, and time for some dessert. One of the best candy bars known to man, the Fast Break. So this is chocolate, peanut butter, and nougat. It's literally next level. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna eat half of this, and then uh, I'm gonna put the other half in the refrigerator, because put it in the fridge, and then it kind of gets like the, the nougat a lot kind of tougher, chewier, and it's just perfection. So I'm gonna eat half. Mm, look at that. Mm. 
fuego. So have any of you guys had a fast break before? If so, let me know your thoughts down below. Oh, and also, let me know your favorite candy bar down below. I'd have to say my top three favorites, uh, the fast break, the three musketeers, and then maybe a Snickers, I don't know. But yeah, the fast break definitely takes the cake. Mm. Right. I'm gonna put the rest in the fridge. We'll be back for that later. Hola. Where are we going, Nikki? Uh, siete y once. Siete y once, nice. 7-11. Pulling up to the crib. Oh, God damn. Seven, oh, you can get a free Slurpee. Because it's their birthday month. Oh, really? Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. If it's free, it's for me. <laughs> if it's free, it's for me. They'll be like, man, you're too old for a Slurpee. <laughs> oh, you're too old for a Slurpee. <laughs> How about you pick what I eat? I pick what you eat? Yeah. No sugar. Oh, this one has like zero. Oh, zero erythrol. sugar. I used to drink those when I was fasting. Is that how you got all muscles? I fasted and ate nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I can really go for some buffalo wings or some chicken strips. They look really good. Maybe some boneless wings. Like how about the new item? Looks yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want a hot dog. Oh, wait. Fresca paleta. Fresca paleta. Can't remember the last time I had one of them. Yeah, get us one. 130 calories. First three ingredients: beef, pork, and mechanically separated chicken. Nice. <laughs> Turkey and cheddar. Yeah. Say with the cheddar. 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 That looks good. <laughs> this whole meal is just 100% processed. Yeah, it is. It's just a bag. Might as well wash it down with like a Coca Cola or something. How to build muscle for, for cheap. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna get one of these to balance things out a little bit because this is horrible. There we go. Sorry, banana. Got the goods? Got the goods. Mmm. Open that stick up. Six grams of protein. Mmm. Very funny. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> nah, beef jerky is definitely better than some ribs. <gasps> what do you think? Hot topics. I don't know. Comment down below. <laughs> some gyms or beef jerky. This is kind of good though. I like the spiciness. I ate gas station food while driving in my car for 24 hours. <laughs> 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 Where would we end up? Massachusetts. <laughs> <laughs> it takes about 21, 21 hours to get there. I did a cheat day once, um, driving up the coast. Oh, really? Mm hmm. Next. Next. Next up, we got a Lunchable. Again, another item. I can't remember the last time I had it. That's how you get your muscles? <laughs> <laughs> Lunchables. <laughs> Packed with protein. <laughs> Stinky meat. <laughs> the mystery meat. <laughs> a block of cheese. <laughs> Go. Wow. <laughs> 260 calories. Jeez, that's hefty for a little box. There you go. Oh, of course. How was that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Super oh, the healthiest part of the meal. <laughs> Wait, all the bad food. <laughs> Cancels it out. Ugh. I just 
tastes so good. Great pre workout snack. <laughs> wow, one box. This whole thing is only 250 calories. Yeah. There's no way. I used to really love the Golden Grounds one. You ever have the Golden Grounds one? Yes. Yeah, freaking good. Buy it. This one's good too. The cinnamon, cinnamon Toast Crunch is like one of the best cereals. Yeah. What's going on next? I have Valley? no idea. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't really know that gas station so good, so I don't know if they would have I mean, food like that. Can't, but I can't really think of it. Wow. This cup in it. It's like strawberry cream. This is how we met. Yeah. <laughs> I was eating strawberry bites in the in the Walmart. Until this day people still comment like Oh yeah. Did you pay for those strawberry bars and the watermelon? <laughs> I was like, of course I did. They think just because I was eating it in the store that I didn't pay for it. Yeah. I pay for everything from Walmart. It's so refreshing, like really cold items on a cheat day. Oh, yeah. Because like you're eating like a lot of food, a lot of volume, a lot yeah. of salt. So you just get like super thirsty. And like ice cream bars are like the best. Strawberry and cream. Imagine doing a cheat day on a moped. That'd <laughs> <laughs> be fun. Oh, I'll show you that other house that was for sale down here. What's in the box? Illegal items. Come on, what's in the box? What's in the box? Come on. But there was a house over here for sale. They wanted 350000 for it. Yeah. And the inside, it yeah. looked like a hoarder. Like, a, there was yeah. just, like, stuff piled up. Like, I can't even believe that they posted the, the pictures <laughs> of the house like that. Like... You know, like, it's crazy. That was 7-Eleven. And mm. I think by far that was the worst meal today. <laughs> <laughs> there, was, there was just like no good options in there. You know? no. It was just all processed, like preservative filled foods. But Wawa, Wawa's got a fresh like sandwich shop. That was amazing. Yeah. But yeah, that was this meal. And then um, I think we'll do one more meal for the day. I'll give it a couple hours and then hopefully we can find a gas station that has some really good food, so I'll be back. Alrighty, folks. Okay, I'm recording now. <laughs> we are going back to Wawa. Wow. Wawa's got the goods. They have like fresh made sandwiches and yes. all the other gas stations basically just have Trash. Kind of what like 7 Eleven had. <laughs> it was so bad. I regret not going to Wawa three times today. <laughs> or four. But alright, we are back here for the final meal of the day. It is 7 22 p.m. How are you feeling, Zoe? Good talk. <laughs> I need something with protein because that last meal had zero protein. <laughs> yeah, I guess I know. They got like an icing. And a whole bee. Oh, now you want to get a slurpee? <laughs> Give us that dance stance. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Before I weigh it. Man, you're a pro. <laughs> you, got, you got prior experience? Hey, man, I'm halfway to 70. <laughs> Those look terrible because they're just like, like sitting in a package all day. Reese's puffs, Reese's puffs. Peanut butter chocolate. Chicken butter. Oh my god, I'm a fast break. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had one of these in like so long. So long. <laughs> oh, they got pasta dinner? They got spaghetti and meatballs? What? Oh, Oof. Mm. I'm all about that. Mm. Yeah. From here. Oh. Gotta have Broke a walk. <laughs> For dinner. Hold <laughs> <laughs> it in. Hold it in. Resist the urge. 
Thank you. We don't need any debt there. Buy <laughs> so 4K. You chase me down. <laughs> yes, please. Poor favor. Poor favor. Got the goodies. Got the goodies. Alrighty, folks, we are back for the last and final meal of this eating gas station food for the entire day. So, we did go back to Wawa because they just had the best selection. Like, I don't know what other gas station you can get a bowl of pasta with meatballs and um, yeah it just looks really delicious so check this out all right here we go bon provecho Oof. oh damn that is delicious Damn, Wawa. I think Wawa definitely takes the gold for um, the best gas station food. Mm. That is delicious. Yeah, so I did get oregano, salt, pepper, um, Parmesan cheese. Yeah, it is. Mm. Definitely the best thing I ate all day. For sure. All right, it's actually really hot, so I'm gonna let it cool down. But I'm gonna try out this panino that uh, Mickey told me to try. So it's like a salami wrapped mozzarella cheese. Nine grams of protein. Yeah, that's pretty good. I definitely think it could use a little more of like the salami though. The cheese definitely does overpower it. Yeah, it's definitely good, but uh, I think it needs more of a, more meat, a lot of cheese. Don't get me wrong, I love cheese, but maybe one more slice of salami. Back to the pasta. Oh, we also got a VA juice. So this is 100% vegetable juice. Getting some vitamin and minerals for the day. Well, I did start the day with taking um, my off the greens and off the reds. Start every morning with them. They're packed with vitamins, minerals, antioxidants, probiotics that help with digestion. And uh, I mean, I didn't film them because I just started the day. I All right, now we're gonna move on to the Reese's. Yeah, two cups in here. Oh, I should have probably put this in the fridge. I still have the fast break, but you know I'll save that for another day. I'm sure all of you guys know what a Reese's, Re Reese. Reese's. Chocolate peanut butter cups. And now, time for this chocolate chip ice cream sandwich. This is uh, 380 calories for this little guy. Hmm. Genius creation. All right. Well, I think uh, I think I'm good with the food for the day. 
Well, alrighty, folks, that was a full day of eating gas station food. So it was a pretty fun, interesting day. Um, we did start out at racetrack, then we went to Wawa, then 7-Eleven, and then Wawa once again. I'd say the worst meal was probably 7-Eleven. Pretty much zero selection for like any cooked food. Uh, they had no wings, no hot dogs, no pizza. Yeah, so it was very limited. They just only had those taquitos that I don't know how long they had been there for. But I'd say the best thing that I ate today was definitely that pasta from Wawa. It was basically made right there in front of you and super fresh. So I think Wawa takes the cake for the best gas station food of the day. Yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the video and be sure to check out Slate. The link will be down in the description box down below. You can save 15% with code Nick15. And yeah, that is gonna be today's video. So. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.